hey, this is Angie Brown, and this fall along, I wanna create a, uh, a branch from an issue. We've probably done it before, but let's do it again because maybe we'll learn something different if we do it slightly different. Um, and it seems to be a very important topic for the exam. So we do have this issue from before. I'm just gonna go ahead and close this as this one is uh, done. And I'm gonna go back up here and we'll make a new issue. We'll call this issue cooler issue, right? Cooler issue. And what I wanna do is I want to create a branch. So what's interesting is you can link a branch, you can link a branch or a pull request. I think we've created a branch this way, but we've never uh, done it the other way. So let's just go ahead and create a branch. And you can see that's pretty straightforward. I don't think that's super exciting. Um, notice that the branch has to be one of the branches you have here. Uh, so sorry, I guess you could actually associate it to an existing branch. So uh, repository destination, change branch source. Oh, sorry, what you're branching from. Okay, that's what that's for. But yeah, we can create a branch there, pretty straightforward. Uh, but let's do this the other way. We're gonna go ahead and create the branch first and then connect an issue to it. So I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna say new, super cool branch. Super cool. And we'll go ahead and do that. We'll go ahead and create our issue. This will be, whoops. <laughs> this will be our super cool issue, right? and I'll just put cool in here. That's emojis, that's how you use them. And uh, what we can do here is then click here and it says link branch or pull request. Most times we've been doing this with pull requests, but we'll do this with um, uh, a branch now. And so look at the icon that tells you what it is. So these are, um, these blue ones, I, I pretend like I know, these blue ones are our, um, Branches, these purple ones are our pull requests. And this green one here is, I have no idea. Is that another issue? Can you link issues to other issues? Can you? No, that's not that that is. So that's something. What is that? Is it like an old one? No. I know we made that. What is it? Number test. Number test. What is that? Okay, we should find that, well, what well, that is. We'll go here, and so now we've applied a branch the other direction, okay? But uh, I really wanna know what that number test thing is. It's another branch, okay? So then why was it colored differently? That's what I wanna know. Maybe it was a branch, maybe it's a branch that's been merged in before, that's probably why. So that's probably what they're doing. So they're both branches, it's just that branch has already been merged again, so you'd be using an old branch that you, that you've already done. I think that's what they're trying to indicate there. They don't really like tell you about these uh, icons anywhere. If they are in the documentation, they are super hidden. But I wanna go back here and take a look. See, now this one's blue, this one's blue. Yeah, so these ones I think are ones that have been um, number test green. So green is, it's already been merged in. You can see the icon, it shows that it looks like it's been merged in and it shows that it's a branch. So this is actually a, uh, a branch that has been merged, okay? But uh, yeah, hopefully we learned something new or we got a bit extra practice and I'll see you in the next one, okay? Ciao.